We're here in Sandwell at Menzies High School where we've been meeting head teachers from right across Sandwell District and they're still reeling from the news a week ago that um, they thought they were going to get brand new schools. In fact, they were told by Michael Gove things were all on track and then the next day the message came it was a mistake and in fact Sandwell schools are all um, off, they've been cancelled like uh, almost 700 schools around the country. And the message from the head teachers was a combination of anger and confusion but also real distress. This was about raising the aspirations of almost 12,000 uh, pupils here and suddenly that's all dashed. The opportunity for schools to work together, to invest in vocational learning, all gone. And they were saying to me, what can we do? And I said, well look, all we can do is um, join with actually Conservative and Liberal Democrat MPs around the country, as well as MPs here, the council, the leader Dan Cooper, to say to Michael Gove, please rethink. This is economically mad, but it's also so wasteful for our children's future. Think again, let's uh, get this programme back on track. I'm here with Mr Heavisides, who's the head teacher here, and you're actually putting two schools together, um, a merger, and the new building was an important part of that. It's an essential part of it. The, the, the plans for the merger and, and BSF were inexorably linked, um, and they were all part of the, the National Challenge Programme, bringing two schools that were underachieving, but with, with aspirations that were being raised on a daily basis. And the idea was to, to, to join the two together, use the BSF funding to create a new learning environment, and to create a beacon of hope, if you like, within the community. And you're going ahead with the merger now, but at the moment without a new building? We're going ahead with the merger without a building. So we, we, we feel as though we're, we've really had our legs cut from, from underneath us. We will make it work for the children. That's, that's the nature of people in education. But if you were to ask me, is it going to be as good? Is it going to be as effective? Um, and is it going to be as uplifting? The answer's got to be no. You can see that there's great frustration here. I remember visiting one new BSF school and one of the children saying, we never thought we were worth this kind of investment. Unfortunately, uh, the young people at the moment here in Sandwell are not going to get that uh, boost and it's going to make um, the job of head teachers like Mr Heaviside even harder. And you can see from this building, this building needs new investment, it needs a new start. We are determined to try to give the young people in Sandwell that fair chance and um, I do hope people will come and join the Day of Action next Monday. Try to persuade Michael Gove, do change your mind.